Um, so uh, lastly, uh, we, we implemented a new award um, a couple of years ago, and uh, it's called the Spirit of Somerville Cambridge Elder Services Award. And it recognizes an employee who embodies the best of who we are at Somerville Cambridge Elder Services. This award recognizes somebody who is a difference maker and also makes everyone around them better through caring, commitment, and teamwork. The first two awards uh, over the last two years were presented to Milagro Mancia, a home care, uh, home delivered meals, uh, uh, sorry, nutrition department, home delivered meals supervisor, and to Betty Mitchell, our um, recently retired uh, office, office manager. And uh, here to present the award, and this is the finale of our program today, is uh, uh, Stephanie Becker Stone, the clinical director uh, for SDS. Stephanie. Hi, everyone. Okay, so on um, this award, I'm pleased to honor today uh, Courtney Johnson, who is a clinical social worker in our behavioral health program, Connect. Um, is Courtney here? Just want to make sure that she's on the call. Hi, yes, I am. Hi, Courtney. Okay, so um, I can think of few people who are mo more dedicated to client work than Courtney. One particularly salient quality is her perseverance and willingness to go the extra mile to accomplish a goal for a client. Uh, in addition to providing vital emotional and mental health support during COVID, she has provided persistent concrete assistance with a vast array of tasks, such as accessing telehealth appointments, facilitating dog fostering for a client with physical limitations, and addressing hoarding conditions. Courtney's clients um, always speak incredibly highly of her support, and um, they often never want to terminate with her. That's always a challenge for us, is they never want to let go of Courtney. Uh, in addition to her regular client work, Courtney stepped up to offer volunteer assistance during COVID and delivered meals to clients on multiple occasions. She is really the definition of a team player. Um, she even conducted an in-person visit, this was earlier on in COVID, um, on behalf of a colleague to assist a particularly at-risk behavioral health client with reconnecting his phone, um, which was very important. He was quite at risk and no one could, could get in touch with him. She's also helped to facilitate group supervision for our interns, presenting on specific topics to help enrich their educational experience at uh, Somerville Cambridge, and she has personally supervised two MSW interns. So Courtney really captures all of the agency's core values in her work and in her collaboration with others. She's consistently warm, kind, and patient with both clients and colleagues alike. She's incredibly reliable, very autonomous in her work, and um, she's truly a delight to work with. We are so fortunate to have her. Thank you, Courtney. Thank you. <laughs> you like to say anything, Courtney? Uh, <laughs> I appreciate the recognition, um, and I enjoy my work and working with all of you. Um, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I second everything that Stephanie said and more. I just know that, you know, ever since I you started right about the time I did, I think, and you came in as a student and, and immediately stood out and we said, we got to figure out how are we going to hire Courtney? What can we do to get her on board? Um, so, and I, and I just want to say also, I appreciate that um, during COVID, you were one of the very first people to get out and see clients because your clients were most at risk and you just said there's a need. So thank you so much for that. 